Yeah, that mustache. I be want to cut that bitch off. Ha, <laughs> he don't cut my shit off, man. I be cutting that shit off, but shit. I'm still weird, though. I think I am. I'm cut my shit off. Just trim that bitch. Just trim my shit. I'm going to find a question real quick. Y'all give me a second. Yeah, I get my shit trimmed. See that side though? See that side though? Yeah, I get my shit trimmed. You know. Yeah, I'm gonna tell y'all something, man. Man, look, man. I don't. I doubt any one of y'all might know Alex or can get in touch with Alex. But y'all, we haven't heard from Alex since I left to uh, Miami. Like that was like two weeks ago, babe. Mm -hmm. I haven't heard from that boy in two weeks. My other cameraman, Mario, that who cool with Alex, he haven't heard from Alex. Nobody haven't heard from Alex, dog. So like, I'm kind of starting to get a little concerned. You feel me? At first, I like Alex probably just somewhat goofing off, but. Nobody heard from him, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? I don't know what's going on. I don't know if he alive. I don't know what, I don't know where the hell that boy at. So, we got to figure out where the fuck that boy at. See, I don't know where he stay at, none of that shit. So, you know, we got to figure out where my boy at, man. We, we, we look concerned now, man. We ain't heard from that boy. That boy had two weeks. That boy had fell off the face of the earth. No okay. cap. I don't know how. Hear me? He gotta be going through something. I don't know what going on. I just know it ain't right. I don't know where my phone out. We're gonna find that boy though. We're gonna see what the fuck that boy at, man. Somebody said how I deal with the scratch though. Man, you know. After going through that shit so long, you, you, you learn how to ignore a lot of shit, man. Like, when it come down to hate, like, anything, you know. Hey, Boots. He ready for you. You learn to ignore that shit, man. You know what I'm saying? My boy to put me back in the game. My mama, my boy, I feel like I'm a motherfucker champ now. I ain't gonna lie to you. But you, 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 you learn to ignore a lot of shit, man. I don't even stun shit. I be out there, bit my bed, motherfucking life. I can't lie to you. So, I know my barber here, though, y'all. I'm not with you, my nigga, man. You know what I'm saying? My nigga. My nigga, give me. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead and get your cut, cuz. Cause you look like a damn fool too. Uh huh. You look like a goddamn fool too, boy. Don't, 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 don't say I ain't tell you. you know, I'm, got them food. You know, I'm going to tell you. Put the cardi ass on. Mm -hmm. I don't know what the fuck on my... All right, now nah, look. Damn, boy. I finally saw my head now. <laughs> boy, I had a hat on all goddamn week. I wasn't showing that bitch for shit. I can't go out no haircut. Let me, uh... Calm down. What the fuck? Calm down, for real, for real. Calm down. Carmen? Carmen is in CJ room. Somebody say, I'm, I'm trying to find some more courses for y'all. Turn the jacuzzi on a little bit. Tripping. Mm, when you gonna start back, when you gonna start giving back to your community? Time my hometown. I'm actually gonna put some shit in my hometown right now. But I put like a lounge down that motherfucker, like a bar arcade type shit. They need that. And I think I'm trying to put a Zaxby down there. You know. I got a lot of shit I be. I do like a lot of real, like my real shit that I do. When I give away shit. 
Like the, the the big shit, I don't post it. I don't know why. I don't think about posting it. Like, you know. And then like sometimes I want to post it because I be want to show people that I really be giving back a lot. But then again, I don't post it because people will be like, uh, you only post it, you only doing it for social media and all that type of shit. So that's why I don't really post like when I do like my real like when I be giving away like a lot of shit, like blessing people. But like the only thing I post on this bitch when I give away is when I got them when I be doing them down the cash or giveaways. And I be giving away thousands of dollars doing that shit, but I mean it's like when I do that shit, it don't mean nothing. Well, it mean a lot because I be blessing people, but I be giving away thousands of dollars and like that ain't no money to me for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? So I, I like it don't bother me to bless people. Like I give, I give somebody a thousand dollars real quick. I, I just gave somebody a thousand dollars the other day. Okay, I swear to God, I just gave somebody a thousand dollars the other day. I be blessing people all the fucking time. I just don't post that shit, but I don't know. I just don't like talking about it. Cause I social media, social media a bitch. Motherfuckers on social media straight hypocrites. You can't never win on social media. You don't you don't show it, they gonna say you don't give you don't, you don't bless somebody. Ah, oh, you don't you don't give away to your community. You are like say for example, I can go buy a new car right now. First thing they gonna say, Oh, you spend all that money. You, you ain't even uh you ain't bless nobody, you can be blessing people. Alright, cool. But they don't know that I am blessing people. But the moment I do post that I'm blessing people, oh, uh, like, why, why, why is on the internet? Why you did it for the internet? Or oh, why you posted it? Uh, you should have just did it in private. You can't never fucking win on social media, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, that's why I just do shit that, that, that satisfies me, you know? I need to do this. Y'all need to go get some of this. Go get some of this right here. If y'all ain't got this here, go get some of this. It's really helpful. I don't know if y'all can see it for real, for real, but go get that. This shit really helped your skin. You know, it, it, it really clean your skin. Some of y'all baby dirty as a motherfucker. Y'all don't even know it. Y'all baby dirty in here. Your skin be dirty as shit. You put this shit across your face and that be a black, your ass dirty for your dirty ass. You all on social media talking shit, your ass dirty as shit. You a dirty motherfucker. I, I'ma clean myself. You see, y'all went through this bit like five times. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna make sure I'm clean. And I'm gonna take a shot of this shit. You feel me? I don't give a fuck. Make sure I'm. I know. Uh uh. Make sure I'm clean, cuz. Especially y'all that be wearing that makeup. Your shit gonna come out dirty as hell. I know some of y'all girls be having their little makeup cleaner, but y'all gotta clean, keep yourself clean, man. See, look, I don't even brush my hair, right? Look at my, look at my shit. I'm telling y'all, I don't know. My ways are just naturally there. They are naturally there. I can have a fucking nappy ass head. Brush that shit. The moment I get out, cut out, them bitches just calm. I'm like, what the fuck? Let me see. I'm going to answer some of y'all questions. Uh, let me see, man. Hmm. Somebody say, do I hate that the Prince family is richer than you? If anything motivate me, I'm not no hater. I don't hate nothing. I don't consider myself a hater after I say this shit, but the only thing that I hate, I just hate people. So that means like I hate myself, right? Well, no, because it's kind of different. Like, I don't hate it. It's just like I dislike it, put it like that. Because it's weird to me. I be saying, like, why you hate something? Why you hate when you can do the same shit? Like, it go always be somebody that got more money than you, my nigga. I don't look at people's pockets, though. That's the difference between me. I don't care about how much money somebody got because at the end of the day, as long as my bank account straight, that's all that matters to me. You can have $10 million in your bank account. I got $5 million in mine. I'm cool with that. Let me tell you why. Because I'm still working. So I'm going to get that $10 million one day. You feel me? I'm not worried. But the thing is, I'm still living my business life. Just how you living your business life. You got to look at it like this. Everybody different that got money. You feel me? Like, say, so you got certain niggas that got money, right? They go buy Lamborghinis and shit. They go buy Lamborghini. They buy designer clothes. They, they, every time you see them, they got designer clothes. They got Gucci, Burberry, all that crazy ass shit, the crazy ass shoes. You got certain niggas that got money. They love jewelry. They buy a whole bunch of jewelry. Every time you see them, they got hella jewelry on. I'm going to show y'all some shit by rappers y'all don't know. Now, I'm not exposing nothing. I'm just keeping it real with y'all. It's a lot of rappers out here right now. A lot of rappers out here. You got rappers, right? That got cars with no house. 
You got rappers that got house with no car. You got rappers that got jewelry and money with no house and no car. You got YouTubers out here that got a house without the car, so free. they got a regular car. You got YouTubers out here that got like a little normal ass house with a with a fire ass car. Like it's it's with it's whatever you fucking like. You know what I'm saying? See, people be on here trying to compete with everybody on social media. That's where y'all be fucking up at. Like everybody be like, man, cool, why you ain't got your Lamborghini yet? Cause I, I I'm not I don't want it just yet. Like when I wrote that bitch, I'm gonna get that motherfucker. You feel what I'm saying? Like it's reason why I ain't got that motherfucker yet. I don't got nowhere to put no goddamn them in so I'm not gonna go buy that shit just to make y'all see that I got money. You feel what I'm saying? People are like, oh, he can't afford it. Woo, woo. I'm like, if I can't afford it, I got half a million dollars of cars in my yard. I don't think I had to do it. Just get rid of some of them and just buy that bitch. You feel what I'm saying? It's just like it's whatever you prefer. You feel me? Like, I salute niggas though. I salute everybody. I salute. Listen, let me tell y'all something about Corey, man. Y'all try to make me hate people so bad. Listen, I salute the Prince family, Damien Bianco. I every YouTuber, you can call them. I don't give a fuck. CJ So Cool. Uh, this is off the dome of my head. Who all? Uh, it's just a, it's a lot of it's a lot of boys, goddamn it. Everybody who y'all name. Um uh who else? Uh shit. I don't give a fuck. Nikki King, Chris and Trey, Ari, everybody. I don't give a fuck who they is, all the YouTubers. I salute them. You feel me? My main thing is, man, everybody out here, we all come from nothing, nine times out of ten. Ain't none of us come from no rich ass family. You feel what I'm saying? So we all come from nothing. They out here, they doing their thing. They they living it up. You feel me? They successful. Even the little even the little you, the YouTuber that's coming up right now, even the ones that's 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 growing, I salute them. You feel me? I'm not no fucking hater. You can't pretty much afraid of all them motherfuckers. I don't care who they is. You know, one thing about the YouTube community, bro, it's just like Black people is like stuck in a bubble where they feel, where we and it and it's sad but it's true and, and it's like it's just something that that got to be broken. I don't know when. It's like you good, baby. Yeah. Come here, give me a hug. You need a hug. Come here, come here give me a hug real quick. I feel like you need a hug. I'm giving up. But we in a bubble where we feel like a lot of us don't want to come together because we feel like as if. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. This is all she want here. That's what she want. That's what she want. No. Come on, give me a hug. First of all, first of all, let me see your nails. Let me see your nails. No. Let me, no, let me see your nails. No, Come on now. Let me see. Let me, no. let me see what you want to got to sell, baby. Let me see what you got here. Let me see. Let me see about like. Ooh. Okay. That look different. That. Oh, you got a little harder now. I thought that. That's pretty. Let me see your toes. Yeah, you know, like the white toes. They get. They. They get playing hard. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> let me see the eyebrows. Okay. The uh, eyebrow looking good. All right. Yeah, you look good, baby. Let me do it. Come on, give me a hug. Come on, give me a hug. There you go. Uh -huh. What are you going to eat? I'm eating a minute. You ready to eat? Yeah. All right, I got you. Okay, you ready? And so fat, you grab that motherfucker. What are you going to say? I'm just saying. But, all right. So, like I was saying, I think I got to wipe the motherfucker. The skin on my face, this shit. <laughs> I have to put right with the skin on my face, boy. I be rubbing it. I got to get myself clean, man. I don't like them dirty, especially my skin oily. But all right, so look, so when it comes down to the black community and YouTube, bro, it's like motherfuckers feel like you people trying to use you. You feel me? And nobody don't want to feel like they're being used. Like for example, us big YouTubers, right? It be all these small YouTubers that 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 try to come hang around the big YouTubers. And and one thing people don't understand, man, is the levels of this shit. You feel me? Like you don't see me hang around the uh, the Ace Family uh, or or Jake Paul, Logan Paul, you know all the motherfucking white YouTubers. They got seventeen million, ten million subscribers. You don't see us hanging around them, do you? Hell no, because they on a whole another level, and we respect that shit. Until we get there, we'll hang around the motherfuckers. You feel what I'm saying? We hang around the people who bracket we in. So if you're a YouTuber and you down here. You need to hang with the people that's down there with you. So, therefore, y'all can come up together. And then once y'all come up, y'all be able to hang with the big motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Now, unless you got a bag. Unless you got unless you got a bag. you like, look, I want to invest in my YouTube channel. Here you go. I'm going to pay you to help me. Then you just pay your way in. You got, it's just rap. It's the same thing with rap. If you're a rapper, let us say you're a rapper, right? You're a small rapper. And you want to hang with one of these big-time big rappers. 
If you come with a motherfucking bad nigga and you tell that rapper, look, I want to do a, a song with you, whoop, whoop, and you actually cool, you know no weird shit, they go fuck with you. So you just paid your way in. That's just how it go. It's just respect, bro. You gotta pay your. You either pay your way in, or you go either gain your respect to get your way in. Simple as that. You're not gonna just come up and just hang with a big motherfucker when you down here, bro. Cause motherfuckers gotta see that. Okay, yeah. Uh, they they worth it. You feel me? So it's that with YouTube. Like I salute all YouTubers, bro. I'm not a hater at all. Even if you're not a YouTuber, I salute everybody. I'm not a hater. I'm just not a hater. I don't give a fuck what you do. You work at McDonald's. You work at motherfucking. So way you work at Church of Chicken, you work at the gas station, you work at CVS, you work at a motherfucking food restaurant. I don't give a fuck what you do. If you out there, bitch, and you doing something good for yourself, cuz, and you ain't hating on nobody else, I salute you. And I pray to God you get rich one day. On my mom. I hope that you can be rich as fuck one day. I, even if you ain't rich, I hope you become comfortable one day when you just financially stay. Well, watch my hand. I'm eating my food. Because I love a motherfucker. Who ain't hating on nobody. Who mind their own business. You know. Cool as, cool as fuck. I, I want all y'all to see success, man. There ain't too many niggas like, like me. I don't know what the fuck wrong with just seeing somebody doing good in their life. You got to hate on motherfuckers all the time. Like, man, come on, man. What reason you got to hate on somebody all the time? If you get, on, you get on social media and talk shit, have fun, that's a different like what I just did the other night without messing with Shay, 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 Chad, whatever the fuck What I did that night, I wasn't doing no hating ass shit. I was just trolling and having fun. Green take that to the room. Okay. Yeah, I was just trolling and having fun. It's a difference when you hating and you just having fun. Like, like think about it. One thing I hate about one thing I hate about Instagram, bro. Now, you got normal ass people who sit on Instagram all fucking day long in the shade room comments and talk shit about every fucking celebrity they post. Y'all can sit in the comments and talk shit and joke and play, say crazy that shit all day. But the moment we do that shit, it's a problem. It, it, it's a big ass problem we want to do it. Like, nigga, they always tell us to be humble. So we humble. We. I'm like, okay, if you look at it, I be on, I be on Instagram, I comment on a lot of shit, you know, I just show people that, man, look, I see y'all, I see the shit, just how y'all see it, I have an opinion, just how y'all have an opinion, I'm, I'm gonna I'm a come in, I'm gonna communicate with y'all, I'm gonna I'm chop it up with y'all, I'm gonna laugh with y'all, I'm gonna joke with y'all, I'm gonna have fun with y'all, but the moment we do it, it's a problem, like some bitch go tell me the other day, I had comment on the song with the, the, the baby shit, I said, people hear what they want to hear. That people gonna tell me why you in the comments. You you should have kept your comment to yourself. The fuck you mean I could have kept my comment to myself, bitch? Why you keep your comment to yourself? <laughs> Motherfucker be tripping. I can't say nothing, but you can say something. It ain't my business, but it when your business. Tripping. 